Hey guys, this is Dana with Dara Holsters. I'm making this video to clarify a couple of the comments that we got on the reel that I had posted to Instagram a couple of days ago. I wanna start by saying that this is not a magnet. This is the Ram Mounting Systems flat surface mount. It is not a magnet. It is bolted in with four different screws and you can mount it to any flat surface, whether it be a desk, um, a nightstand, or a vehicle, as you can see here. We have it mounted in a vehicle, but if that completely turns you off as it does for some people, you do not have to buy it as a vehicle mount. As you can see, it is very um, secure. It is definitely not a magnet, as a bunch of people have said. It's mechanically mounted using these four bolts right here, and you can tug on it. Um, it's not gonna go anywhere. This is the arm that you secure to the mount, and you will later put the uh, one inch rim mounting ball inside of it and swivel around to mount your holster. So let me go ahead and tighten this together so I can better show you how it works. This is the one inch mounting ball um, made by Ram Mounts and this is our ALQD receiver. This is the auto locking um, quick disconnect system. It is proprietary and will only fit our own whole pattern. So you cannot adapt this to any other quick disconnect system. Um, we do call it the auto locking quick disconnect because I don't know if you can see it, but there are two tabs on the inside where you depress the button, you insert the uh, ALQD mount, and then if you release the button, they lock in around the mount. And that means that it is auto locked, um, very, very secure, again, not a magnet. Um, so what you're gonna do here is you're gonna put the ball in the mount and it's like a ball and socket. So you can stick it in there, you can swivel it all around, position it how you want, and then tighten down the arm. And that's really gonna lock it down. Um, this is a rubber ball, so it doesn't just slide around. It's not like you're putting two pieces of plastic in and tightening it. You're actually putting the um, plastic onto rubber and it, it's very solid and secure. So you'll wanna tighten it and um, lock it down in the position you want. Usually, um, if you're getting it in a vehicle and you're mounting it to the bottom right of the steering wheel, you'll want to make sure that you get either a right-handed OWB holster or if you buy a mounted holster, which is, um, is the same thing essentially, but it's just gonna come with the ball attached, you'll wanna get it mounted on the left so that if you're right-handed and you go to draw, the mount's gonna be on the right side. Well the correct side, not the right side. It'll actually be on the left. But as you can see, ball and socket mount, you can swivel it each way you want. I'm gonna go ahead and tighten it all the way down and mount the holster to it. All right, so here we have the holster. This is an OWB holster with ALQD mount only selected for the belt attachment. I'm gonna go ahead and mount it to the ALQD receiver by depressing the button and then releasing to make sure it's locked in there. Now I'm locking the manual safety at the bottom left. Here's how you have your holster. Um, like I said before, you wanna make sure if you're right-handed, you have the mount on the left. And then once you have your holster attached, you can loosen that little um, knob and then kind of reposition as you'd like. All right, so I grabbed the um, PDP F-Series 4-inch with the Swamp Fox optic mounted to the slide. As you can hear, it clicks in pretty well. Um, I'm kind of, you know, messing with it a little bit. It's not going to go anywhere. Um, the retention is factory set to, I believe, six to seven um, draw pounds of resistance. Um, you can adjust further from there, but um, you have to be deliberate. You have to draw deliberately. We did see a couple comments complaining that the ALQD had you had to have two hands to remove it um that's kind of the point because you don't want something that's going to be so easily removable yes it's a quick disconnect but you don't want someone to just come up and be able to remove it so it does take two hands um, as far as retention those two screws right there are adjustable you can crank it down to where it's difficult to even draw deliberately um, we also do have a level two retention holster, which will have a uh, hood at the top. So you depress that thumb button and it uh, shoots forward so you can draw. Now this holster is our OWB holster with ALQD mount only. Um, like I said, the draw is tested before it ships out. We test fit with the exact firearm. All of our holsters come optics ready. So here's the mounted holster system. Um, like I said, you really 
don't need to mount it in your vehicle unless you want to. Um, we also offer the level two retention. The ALQD is great because while it is a quick disconnect, yes, you have to be deliberate about it, but that's our mounted holster. So check it out, daraholsters.com.